Now last week, when I combined the hive, um, I was actually stung twice, as once in the jaw and once in the hand after I put the suit on, which is fine. I mean, it's not a big deal. I expected it to happen. Uh, all I want to do today is go through these real quick and see how they're making out. Um, I threw them, or I dumped them out, or I shook them out, out in the field, and they should have all flown back and found that they didn't have a home anymore. And without a home, they should have uh, decided on another hive to live in. So, now I didn't have any inner covers made up because I ran out of materials. So I'm still gonna have to do that. So these lids might be stuck down a little bit, but we're gonna find out. And this is one of the frames that is just full of nectar and honey. And young larva and brood and eggs. Eggs, nectar, honey. Eggs, nectar, honey. And they've drawn out some more comb. And this hive is doing really well. It's what I want to see. There's a lot of pollen in this frame. And the queen's doing a really good job. Last frame, same thing, it's full of brood, it's got cells filled with nectar, uh, honey at the top. And a nice brood pattern on this side. Now I would normally say let's get one to the blue nuke, but it's not a blue nuke anymore.
got nectar and honey and pollen. And this has some brood. I'm not seeing a whole lot of drones in here. But I do see eggs, so we're in good shape. There's a nice brood pattern as well. open cells are laid up and all of these open cells are laid up so in actuality I don't have to go through this whole hive because I've pretty much seen what I wanted to see the queen is in here laying there's a decent amount of brood there's a decent amount of stores like on this frame, this frame's heavy. And they got nectar and honey. And eggs in the center. And nectar and honey. And eggs in the center. This is a frame that didn't have a whole lot on it last time. And they've built out some more comb. And she's laying eggs in these too. heavier frame. It's full of nectar. And this side's full of nectar as well. There's the queen right here. So she's wandering around looking for a space to lay. Now I just said I wasn't going to pull all these frames, but I'm going to anyway. A lot of capped honey, filling it with nectar. And if you look at this side, at the top, they have it bumped out. All of this has been built out where they had extra space with nothing in the way. And that's why I put it up against an empty frame. They'll probably just continue to build that out and fill it with stores, which I'm not that concerned about. This box is a little tighter. Um, when I made it, I based all my measurements on the outside diameter or outside area, and I didn't think about it, but I bought unmilled wood. So it's actually a little thicker than three quarter. So it made the inside area a little bit tighter. Uh, they still have B space. It's just uh, not as much as they normally would have. And I'll make up some inner covers in here and or sometime soon and get them on the hives. But they're doing good. So it looks like the combine worked. Um, I'm going to try to check them next week. I might just let them let them go. 
uh, but at some point I will be out here to put an inner cover on. This way it makes it a little easier to take the top off and it's not as evasive. They don't get as excited. And I have been able to keep my smoker lit. So like, share, and subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.